Hello guys, welcome back to Mufasuket with AutoCAD rendering tutorial how to create a 360 panorama with the cloud and also don't forget to subscribe to our channel here it will be helpful for us to growing up for uh, example I will create a simple object we create a plan shoof okay start from this point to here and you can orbit uh, this drawing I will create a box uh, object uh, in a 3D in here and create a cylinder in here okay we create a shape here in here next I will create uh, the other object like can in here okay and we create a pyramid in here Next, uh, I will create a torus in here. Okay, change into front view. I will move uh, this uh, sapphire object uh, to the top and move uh, this uh, torus object uh, to this point. Okay, change again into top view and we create a camera in a middle point here to this uh, point target change lens into 60 enter and uh, exit okay I will change into front view and move uh, the last object to the top here okay next I will change into realistic view and apply material into this object you can tap uh, Airmat to open material browser Okay, next I will use uh, wood uh, material. You can click here to the library and click uh, wood. And so I will apply this uh, material into this uh, object. Okay, we apply this material into this object. This material into this uh, object. And then another material for this uh, object and in here okay we apply this object and the last i will apply this material into this object can close and then i will save this object you can click save here and i will give name about a example uh, panorama 360 and save okay next I will uh, render this uh, image uh, in uh, render Autodex E360 you can uh, open your browser and click uh, rendering 360 Autodex E360 and open uh, your account Autodex and click a new tab here okay select a file we select uh, this file that we created before open waiting for uh, uploading a file into server and uh, for a camera here I will use uh, camera one and for non render quality final and exposure advance okay and we start rendering uh, this uh, project okay we waiting for uh, renderings until uh, finish we finish uh, rendering process and this uh, rendering still in uh, image show in image you can see here and you can click uh, this uh, rendering and click at uh, this uh, icon okay you can click uh, render s and click uh, panorama here okay and you can setting this render quality into final and change width here okay and i think it's enough for a uh, rendering setting and we start rendering for a uh, panorama you can click a uh, start rendering and we waiting for a uh, rendering process you can see panorama here okay 
Oke, okay, we finish uh, rendering for uh, panorama. You can click uh, this image to preview rendering uh, process. Oke. Okay. Now we create a 360 rendering panorama with uh, rendering uh, Autodesk E360. Oke. Okay. You can uh, zoom in this object or uh, you can uh, zoom out uh, click here to zoom out okay to save uh, this uh, project you can click uh, at uh, this icon and you can save uh, download uh, panorama as a uh, html here you can click here and you can save file and okay and we waiting for uh, downloading uh, this uh, object check uh, until uh, finish okay I have uh, another example for uh, 360 uh, rendering this uh, object okay you can see you can uh, preview all uh, object in uh, 360 with uh, this uh, panorama rendering this is a uh, small room okay you can see you can uh, zoom in zoom in again and you can preview this uh, object okay you can click here to zoom out and can preview this object uh, more clearly okay okay we finish uh, downloading uh, previous file you can click here and you can share uh, this uh, HTML file into your friends or uh, your college uh, to preview your uh, drawing uh, object okay and i think it's enough today for uh, autocad uh, basic uh, rendering uh, tutorial how to create a uh, 360 panorama with uh, rendering uh, autodex uh, in a cloud if you have any question about this uh, tutorial you can comment below this video and see you next time in another AutoCAD rendering tutorial.